Everybody good? Good. Good to go. Yeah. Good to go. Come here. Brothers. <laughs> Brothers. All right, guys. We're ready back. We're ready back with the taste store. Okay. Thanks for joining us again. Um, actually, I do want to... Can I discuss something? Okay. I'll make it quick. Okay. Um, a lot of people... Ah, I don't know if I want to discuss this. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I, can, I can just start the episode over. A lot of people... Uh, what? What the hell are you talking about? Ah, I, I, we'll talk about it off camera. We'll, we'll do this episode. This is not good. Say it. We can talk about the episode over. We can talk about the episode over. That's what I'm just saying. But what were you going to say? It, we'll talk about it off camera. I'll, 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 we'll do this episode then. All right. Okay. Don't forget. I won't forget. I won't forget. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Taste Store. We thank you for joining us again on another episode. This time around, we have. Is everybody ready for this? Oh sure. Uh, yes. This time around, we've got the Samuel Adams Pumpkin Batch Ale Brewed with Pumpkin and Spices. It's 5.6 percent alcohol by volume. I think that this is the same as the thing that they did last year, the Pumpkin Harvest. Oh, maybe. I Wait, think that they just changed the name. Both. They, they, Sam Adams oh, does know. that. Sam, it, it's they great. Have the it, it's it's they wonderful, Mark. Oh, it's a right. great idea. The white ale and then a Blue white moon. lantern yes. and then a white Blue this, moon. which all tasted the same. Right. Blue Moon is the pumpkin harvest. Okay. Yeah. Um, so it says here they did something different. Yeah. There was a pumpkin ale, but it was a different name. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So like I said, five point six percent alcohol. It says here New England fields are full of pumpkins this time of year. Well, maybe not this time of year, but our golden hazy saison saison. Okay, our golden hazy saison bursts with the rich flavors of pumpkin and classic fall spices, revealing an earthy, floral, and spicy spirit. Cheers. Cheers. Well, pretty soon up in yeah. New England, they'll be having pumpkin. Give it, give it a couple of weeks. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, that's definitely different. Okay. I don't yeah. even get, I get size on more than anything. Yeah. I don't know much. Well, I'll see. Getting, for all these stuff I got out of that. Swift. I, I, based off the smell, I like the smell. Yeah, I, like I just don't smell. get a lot of pumpkin from it. I definitely like it. <laughs> right. I like it. I do too, but I don't know about the pumpkin. No, no, no. no. Like the pumpkin Maybe. stuff. Well, okay. Let's let's just go ahead and clear the air on the size on piece. It's hard to make us dislike those. Those are so good. Yeah. That's a style that, generally speaking, we we always. Uh, this is a tasty beer. It is a tasty beer. Yeah. I could definitely drink. I just don't this. get the. Right. I don't get a lot of pumpkin. The spices. The I pumpkin agree. And the spices. I, I, I see it could be a good fall beer. I agree, yeah. but I don't see. What I was expecting. I, get, I feel like I smell it more than I taste. I it. get way more just saison flavor. Yeah, maybe it's just because saisons are so flavorful as it is. It's hard mm -hmm. to like match it with the pumpkin spices stuff. I don't. Know. I mean, I get, I get. Maybe it's not there's like some that like cinnamon nutmeg thing, beard. but it's not. The, the, my problem with it is this: it's advertised as a pumpkin beer, and I feel like pumpkin is the side note, not the main dish. If you will. It's yeah. like the, it's like the. the app. Right. Not the entree. It's not the entree, for sure. For sure. To me, the entree here is size yeah. I don't get any pumpkin anywhere. Yeah, not I'm even on the side. It. Not, it's not even a side order. Yeah. I don't even smell it. Really. I get a little bit of cinnamon. Cinnamon. Oh. cinnamon. There is something a little more fall-ish about yes. this than other yeah. sizons, but there's something in it. It's exactly. almost, it's, it's just subtle. It's very subtle, but I could see this being good for fall time. Uh, yeah. I don't know though. It not, certainly not much pumpkin if if you can taste it at all. I don't really get any pumpkin, um, which I don't mind except for the fact that it says pumpkin on it. Like I, I don't. I like the taste of it, and I would probably rate it higher if it didn't say pumpkin on the yeah. bottle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. I'm trying to like figure out how I want to rate this because I like it, but it doesn't taste like what it was. I wonder. To taste like, yeah. Right? In my, in my head. Like, I had this idea of it in my head, and what's in the glass is not that. I'm going to give it a seven, because it's a good beer. It's it just not what yeah. it says. It doesn't do yeah. specifically what it says that it should and, be doing that well. And I would absolutely drink it yeah. and enjoy it. Yeah. Um, 
I think I'd give it like a seven and a half were it not. If it was just a uh, pumpkin If it style. wasn't advertised this way, I'd, yeah. I'd probably be up to an eight, but I'm gonna give it a seven. If, if they said like slightly spiced size on thing. Right, I, I'd probably do around an eight. This I'm gonna give a seven because yeah. I, because I mean it is what it, what it says, pumpkin batch, blah, 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 and on the description. I'm not getting much of that. And I, I do feel like it matters what it's saying it is. Like yeah, it if, it, if, if, it totally if, if a package was to say margarita and it tasted like a good mojito yeah. colada right. or some shit, then it would be like, right. yeah, it'd be like it's good. Like, but yeah, it's I mean it's good, good. but yeah. yeah, I can't. I gotta knock it something for saying it's <laughs> yeah. this. Yeah. I agree. It's I good though. It's a good beer. I, I, I wouldn't be disappointed if it wasn't for the name. Pumpkin, of it. right? Yep. I'm a seven. seven. Six and a half. Six and a half. Yeah. yeah. Anything else to add? Anybody? Good. good. You good? We'll be back at the taste tour. It's a trio of sevens and a six and a half for the Samuel Adams Pumpkin Batch Ale Brewed with Pumpkin and Spices. It's 5.6% alcohol. We will return. 